Hey everyone, welcome to Kip TV. I am Kip, and today I've got a finals match for you. It is the Illumination Bracket third place steal, I think is the entire title. I'm not completely sure, and neither was the person who sent it to me. But regardless, it was a big match. This is a third out of three maps that they played. Uh, first two they obviously tied on, so forced to a third map. So it should be real exciting. The teams. Why didn't you ask? Earlier, we have Goobacast versus Random Assortment of Gents, also known as Rags. So, on blue is Goobacast. We have Pop102, who is late to finals, tut tut for shame, as Spy. Hydro is Sniper. Terra is Scout. Mixlidian is a cool name. And Heavy, Rando M. Critz is Soldier. Rain is Medic. Watchimol is Engineer. Vol is uh, Dumbman. And Azzy is Pyro. Over on Rags, we have Koala Siam is Scout. Axel is Pyro. Dratini is Spy. This blue is Soldier Steve, or S yeah, we'll go with Steve. Is Heavy Purple Rupee is Engineer. Kim Jong Un, also known as Riku, is Sniper. Lock and Load is uh, Demo Man. And Marka is Medic. Not sure who that is, but whatever. Let's get to the rollouts. We have Lock and Load. Locking and Loading. Uh, I'm not sure if he's running Lock and Load. I hope he is, if he's tagged up as this. Um, getting out to mid really nicely, putting down some sticks, and his opposing demon just ran straight into them. Unfortunately, he took a lot of damage right there, so it doesn't look like he'll be able to capitalize on all that damage he could have done. Uh, so we will have to fall back a little bit. Meanwhile, though, Vol did go down. Riku sniped him out of the air, so no more demo man. That damage output, damage output from the blue team will not be there. Now, blue is running the crits, I believe, while red is on the regular Medigon. Uh, uh, advantage of running crits to mid is that it uh, charges so much faster, but because blue's been taking so much damage and stuff, they've had to fall back, and they're not going to be able to um, capitalize on this as soon as they want. They're going to, they have this crits ready to go, but Murka just got his. 100% and I am really happy that he's tagged up as a Murka because that's so much fun to say anyway but no in comes the crits oh my goodness not able to get the oh wow so much happening right there but unable to get the uh, uber pop off going down to the crits bowl with some really nice uh, sticky work right there and this is a huge turning point right now for Goomba uh, Gooba Ooh, whoops, sorry about that for Gooba we'll see if they can uh, turn this match around because the first mid fight looked a little cool, but uh, they may be able to do this remember this guy these guys have been playing for like several hours at this point um, probably exhausted and this is for bronze and steel so it's not like there's a huge audience and uh, fan base waiting for you when you're done so uh, I, I gotta admire all, all the effort and uh, dedication these guys have put into it and gals maybe I'm not sure I was not aware of any ladies who are playing in this match but if there are, I thoroughly apologize. Let's see if Riku can take out this spy who's just jumping around, and he does! Pop 102, who is late to the finals, is not late to that headshot. Oh, uh, he arrived exactly on time. He's just like a wizard, precisely on time. Uh, we do have these crits going down. Vol again getting them and cleaning off the point. A uh, little bit of resistance right there from Jotini, who tried to get in there. Right, got a little bit of time, but not going to happen. And so far, Gooba is doing well. Murka only has 50% Uber right now. So they're trying to push forward, which is a bad idea. Down goes Steve, backstabbed by Pop. Uh, we'll see if Rags can... Uh, come back and do anything with this. Again, Marka doesn't have this uber or anything, so I think he needs to fall back. He's also literally on fire. And there's a demo man who, uh, with a vendetta, I guess. I mean, everyone hates supposing Medic, isn't that it? I uh, want to get on poor Marka's cam, because he's going to have this uber soon, and he's going to need to pop it immediately, I would think. Maybe not, because, oh, he actually did. All right, so I should have gone with my first instinct. Gonna pop it and uh, try to push forward with his heavy right there. And Demo Man Steve getting pop. Um, rain, though, going down. I did not see how that happened, but there goes Murica. Uh, nice rocket to the face. And uh, Was that a crits? Did I miss the crits? Oh, darn it. But Rain goes down. We're back to Abdutini getting that. And in comes Gooba as they push forward. Uh, nice little sticky trap set up right there. We'll see if Vol can't catch any flies. Watch. Is the sniper running back to his spawn? Or is Rando... Or, anyway. Anyway, Rando goes down, not able to survive against that onslaught. Um, and Red gonna make a push here, again, again with no discernible advantage. And Murica's out here, and I'm really scared for him. 
because uh, as you know, minis on Viaduct is pretty standard. So if a medic is running around in center, he easily could be taken down by a mini sentry. He has about half health right now, so he's got to be careful. Meanwhile, Rain is still looks like on that crit creek, charging significantly faster than the regular Uber. So that will happen soon. This blue is in behind the lines, trying to do some damage. Does take down the opposing soldier, but not able to get the scout. But don't worry, Coliseum is in on the case. Can he do it? He does take down Terra. Uh, let's get on. Somebody interesting's cam is usually what I'd want to do. Coliseum in behind uh, the ranks on the sniper desks, and look, he runs into a sniper. Also runs into a heavy. That's not what you want to do, but somehow escapes. Wow. Coliseum with those magic sneakers. He's just going to go after Dumbo Man. No big deal. Two, two health. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> Coliseum going a little bit crazy. Um, maybe it's the Napoleon complex, where he thinks he's bigger than he is, thinks he has more health than he is. You, you really, you really, literally had two health left, sir. But regardless, he stays alive. Uh, right now, Jatini is messing around with the combo. Um, oh, but Steve coming in and lock and load, helping out right there. Oh man, this could be huge for Rags. Um, there is real. That is really going to end Gooba's push or a chance for mid, I would think, because it comes up Pyro from behind. Okay, sure, why not Axel uh, birding the backs of those two. Uh, I don't know if he's running the back burner. Probably not. But regardless, looks like Rags will be able to hold this. Uh, any more players for blue? Yes, there are. Oh, and some big stick is taken down uh, by Vol, taking down the soldier. Uh, Mariko goes down as well, so maybe Gooba can do this. I spoke too soon, which is usually what I do. So a nice comeback for Gooba. Uh, we'll see if they can hold it, though. They do have to hold it for 1 minute and 15 seconds, which is quite long, especially when Rags has held it uh, for so long. Uh, Vol has found the opposing combo. We'll see if he can put it down enough damage. Um, both Steve and his medic taking some damage right there, but it's not going to be enough involved. Vol actually going to have to fall back as he really can't afford to idly throw his life away um, when there's only less than a minute left and you have to stay alive. Uh, especially, that is the same story, especially for Rain the medic. Let's see uh, if Rain is going to pop his crits when he gets it. There's about 30 seconds left. Vol is yelling like crazy. Like, <laughs> we'll see though. Uh, will he have enough stickies loaded for this crits? He is getting it. Uh, charging up. Spotted the combo on the cliff. Can he get anybody so far? No. Nobody with that crits. Unfortunate. A little bit out of position with that pop. Um, but it doesn't matter as we're as rags doesn't look ah uh, here comes the medic and the demo with the uber and this is looking pretty well i am speaking way too soon about everything pyro coming in there and doing some good work but as he goes down to a mini century and rags coming in with the last few seconds they are able to cap and that will be the first round going to random assortment of gents uh we already watched lock and load didn't we we want to watch okay we'll watch a scout we'll watch a scout uh, they have l Hydro and Terra, I get it. Water and land. That's good. Vol going down, immediately taking a pill to the face, lock and load, taking him out, so no demo again for this mid fight for uh, Gooba. We'll see if it affects them like it did last time. They pretty much uh, crumpled on the first mid-fight. They were able to come back and make it very, very close, so definitely not out of it. And looks like Blue not really engaging right here. This may be their strategy that they wanted to put out last time, which is wait until just Blue, till Red thinks that they are safe and then pull out the crits creek. Here comes that crits. Uh, will they be able to get anybody good with it? Not saying that, uh, oh snap, rain right into the pyro. Not a good idea right there. So, not able to um, get as much as they wanted out of that. See, you can see that Red still has quite a few players alive right there. But they were able to get the point, so there you go. Time is starting to tick down for Gooba. We already have 15 seconds down on the clock for Rags. We're going to watch Tratini as uh, maybe he tries to do something interesting. Maybe. Potentially. Hopefully. Oh, look at that sap. Such technique. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, but does get what to watch him all, uh, which is significant. Uh, without the engineers, ooh, ooh, Jatini just started salivating. It's like, oh, this is gonna be so good. This is gonna be so good. He gets the pick. That was so good. Rain going down, dropping crits right there. Uh, big pick for his team. Uh, we'll see if now a Merc or just Merca decides to push off with this. But it looks like they're gonna keep that Uber close and tight where they can 
see it, uh, not pop it yet. Look at the spy bro, spy bro, spy check in action by this pie bro, who is a bro to everyone, um, just constantly spraying around his medic, and uh, that, that is much appreciated. I could only, oh, well, he, he missed his heavy, but whatever, you'd much rather take the heavy down than the medic who is carrying Uber. Uh, no offense, heavy. But uh, we do have a blue coming in, or oh, and finally we have this Uber popped. It's going to be popped on Axel, who's actually doing a great job just pushing everybody out. If he could get some kills, that'd be essential. Heavy is on fire. Uh, can we get an extinguisher kill? Doesn't look like it. Oh, and Axel goes down right there. Uh, so the Uber popped a little bit out of position and not exactly on the right person, I don't think. Um, but Axel managed to blow everyone off the point and stop the capture. So Rag still in control of the point. Coliseum just doing some fancy dances, no big deal. Did you know in his former life, Coliseum was uh, Ginger Rogers, that famous dancer? I don't know if anybody got that joke, but it was funny. She, it was a she from like the 1930s or something. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, it was a bad joke, but Coliseum doing some nice work taking out Azzy. Uh, he'll get right back on the point and probably recap this uh, from... Goomba, but maybe not as uh, a clutch defense coming in there from Gooba. Uh, Rag is going to continue this push, though, devote a lot more uh, team, a uh, lot more players to it. They don't have any uh, uber advantage or anything, but they do think that they will be able to take this without that. So we've got about 60 seconds left. Uh, they do take it. We'll see. Um, we'll see how Gooba decides to uh, answer this. Rain should really focus on staying alive right now. I think they could be, they should be building right here. Uh, in comes the Uber. Interesting decision right here from uh, Rags to pop that Uber and push forward. A uh, little, little crazy. Oh, how comes the bottle that is never a good sign? Oh, man. At least the medic survived. Murka got out of there. So the demo man, but let's be honest, it's America. Everybody wants Murka that everybody is worried about. Vol getting these crits. We'll see if he can go big right here. Uh, needs to find Merka. Does find Merka, sorry, with that first one taking out uh, more. But don't get greedy now. We have got to uh, get the point and defend it. But lock and load with a sticky trap. Uh, taking out three right there, including... No, Rain got out alive. So they will be able to uh, continue hitting up that med. But lock and load can only do so much. And uh, he died as his team uh, still respawning. Not able to uh, get back with the point. And they only have 15 seconds left, so Rags looking pretty good. They don't have uh, to worry too much. As we saw last round, they just bided their time when they had about a minute and 20 seconds left on the clock, or their opponents did, and just put together a really well-coordinated push that won it for them in the last few seconds. Uh, so I am expecting to see the same type of thing out of them this time. Uh, another well-executed push that uh, that only takes one. We'll see, though. It looks like we have this crits ready to go. You can't have a well-executed push if you don't have the medic. And here comes the crits air blasting going on. Some really nice work right there from Axel. And down goes Rain. Did that crits get anybody? It did. I mean, got Purple Ruby, who is important. Of course you're important, Purple Ruby. But, um... Not as important as Murka, who now has this 100%. And Rain did go down after that, so that's going to be significant. Purple Rupee, just quick note, running the short circuit, which I love, on uh, Viaduct. It's uh, definitely helpful if uh, the other demo is getting all the uh, crits. Oh, Spy in trying to stab somebody, but everybody seems to be ubered. So not able to do anything. So really great defense or offensive push right here from rags they will be able to hold this for 10 seconds question mark uh blue just now has to throw anybody onto the point uh gooba doesn't have any spawns in time oh barely vol gets on the point but it gets air blasted off so that's gonna be another gr and rags takes it again so we are 2-0 oh. looks like we uh maybe have a plug-in problem so we'll be right back And we're back with the third round, I think second half. I'm not sure about what happened with the uh, config right there. But we're going to watch Vol in his rollout. He has been winning all these demo fights. Uh, we'll see if it happens again. Uh, I mean, he's been losing all these demo fights. Sorry about that. It's been Lock and Load who's been winning them. Um, but Lock and Load goes down to a backstab. Pop helps out right there and takes out the enemy demo. So Vol will be alive. We'll see if that makes any difference here in this mid-fight. And so far, it seems to be making quite the difference as Blue is pushing up everybody uh, alive except 
they're heavy. That could be significant, but so far it doesn't look like it. And for the first time in this match, uh, Gooba will take mid first. Uh, this blue... The soldier is actually here uh, behind the scenes on the cliff and takes down Rando who came at him. I uh, wonder if, how much damage uh, this blue could do right now. He is very hurt but got some heals. We're going to keep around to him to see. Um, looking, of course, for a medic pick or something, but Rain already popped. And uh, is. N Let's get on the. Oh, Rand do I want the Rando cam? No, I want the, this blue can, but Rando has found this blue. This blue is so down, but so so goes uh so so goes Rando as well. Uh, Rags come back and do cap it. While I was watching all the sniper or the soldier action. Ah, snipers, we haven't seen any sniping action, so we'll get on that cam in a second. How about we get on that cam now? As Riku is leading the server in points. Uh, Riku, what do you got for us? Oh, well, let's check out the Hydro Cam right now. Often you can uh, tell a lot about snipers when you're looking at the other side of the... Looking at them from a scope. Uh, doesn't look like Riku is present. There he goes. Hydro hiding behind the rock. Riku uh, decided to go the barn route. Let's we'll see who will win this sniper battle. Doesn't look like it's going to happen now, but blue team does push in. So Ruba... Uh, Gooba, sorry about that. Gooba... Oh... Uh, Taking the point back from Rags. Rags and Gooba. Those are kind of silly names, but whatever. Uh, we do have this 100% ready from Murka, which is what I'm going to continue calling, Boas. Oh, man. Pop that Uber to save his demo. Not able to get it, though. Backstab going down. Pop getting that big pick. Uh, we'll see if they can do anything with this Uber. They are going to push forward a little, but got to get those kills. Otherwise, it's not worth it. Right now, though, they're losing more than they are gaining. And uh, Gooba is not giving this up. And a really strong defense right there from the blue team. Um, in comes Spy from behind. But don't worry. Dratini is not going to do anything as he is dead dead and on fire. On fire and dead. Regardless, he is both. Uh, we do have this crit ready to go. Who's going to get it? It's going to be popped on the heavy right now. And Maloxian taking down Steve and lock and load. Can he get the med is the question. Looks like uh, Rags' medic is going to get away alive. Oh, snap. But down goes Rain. Actually, down goes Murka as well. Um, didn't see how Murka got taken down, but I just like saying Murka. So there we go. Uh, a little exchange of Ubers, also a little exchange of lives. As uh, now Rando is in behind the enemy scenes um, as his team has control of the point. Uh, given a little payback for this blue, taking down this blue there. And only about a minute left for Goopa as they have held on very nicely. Oh, look what I found! And Rando gets the medic. This heavy has not turned around. Dratini is actually the one who finishes him off right there, but Rando with a really nice med pick. Um, that is exactly what the soldier needs to do on a map like Viaduct if he's playing that roaming role, which he is. Uh, you can always be passive and stay back, or you can be aggressive and just get in behind those lines and get those picks, and that's what was Rando did right there. <laughs> My words are not coming out awesomely tonight, but whatever. Uh, Rags giving everything they got here in these last few seconds. Purple Rupee, can you do it? He's got this mini on the point, and minis are so OP on Viaduct. I will be the first to say it, but OP doesn't always mean bad. Let's just remember that uh, we'll be able to take down this mini sentry, yes, but he takes too much damage. Rags, though, making this final push just in time. They do get to the point. Uh, got a lot of kills in those last few seconds, and that has made all the difference, ladies and gentlemen. That was a... Uh, a reference to the Robert Frost poem. A road diverged in the woods and I took the one less traveled. That has made all the difference. Anyway, Rags has this 100% Uber. We're going to see more soldier battles. This blue does survive this barely. And nope. Pop will finish him off in the back right there. That did not seem gentlemanly. Rags pops this Uber, which is probably a good idea, but they're pushing so far forward. I don't know about this. Um, blue doesn't have to go through this choke, they realize. Um, but was it all a distraction just to get Dratini in behind the medic? <gasps> Maybe it was! Oh! Oh, Dratini can't get that stab! Oh, but uh, Rain does get the pick. We'll see if Myloxin does take down a lock and load, but is that going to be significant enough for Ruba to push back in? Uh, Blue's going to get these respawns in a few seconds, but it may be too late. Uh, three, two, one. That will be the first round to go to Gooba. Nice. Nicely done, Team Gooba. And they win their first round, so it is two to one. Rag still in the lead, but this game ain't over till, till the players decide they 
literally cannot play anymore and they their hands fall off. Which I hope doesn't happen. We're gonna watch the Volcam again, because last time we did it was good luck for him, so um, I don't know, just wishing Vol good luck. Wish uh, Red Team good luck as well, but uh, this demo exchange has been very interesting, and it's been interesting how that's dictated so much of the mid-fight. Um, Blue losing both their Pyro and their uh, Heavy, and with that they are gonna fall back. Vol didn't go down. Oh, looks like, oh man, it's so close to the crits right now. We're going to see that come out immediately if Rain can survive. Rain does because Terror takes out this blue, that aggressive, aggressive engineer. Here comes the crits. We'll see. Um, spotted out the heavy. Takes down Purple Rupee. Uh, Lock and Load is down as well. There goes Riku. Um, but where is the medic? Uh, Boa or Murka is nowhere to be seen. And that is a good medic when you can't find him. Uh, looks like he was back at spawn having a party with the the pyro. Um, that's cool. Nobody else was invited, but whatever. It's not like we want it to be or anything. Uh, so <laughs> they will have this 100% over ready and lock and load will get some of it. Trying to focus down the medic and he does. Takes down rain right there. Some really nice stickies anticipating where he was going. Now trying to finish off this heavy. Gonna yes, take him out as he's a sandwich, but then pop will take him out. Oh man, that sucks. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh. But regardless, well played on all sides, I guess. Lock and load said last resort. Oh no, he's pulled out that he's pulled out that bottle quite a few times. I'm thinking he just uh he just likes that bottle. Uh <laughs> really really interesting choice with the uh, Okay, Rando Crits just pulling some surprising stuff all over the place. Remember, this is the final, so it's not like they're just playing around. This is there are medals on the line here, ladies and gentlemen. He has found now this opposing soldier who, uh, oh, can't go quite for the air shot. Uh, Rando's losing lots of health right now, and maybe this would be a point when it's better to have that uh, uh, escape plan than the shovel. Or is it... Does he have the market gardener out? Uh, but uh, regardless, he's uh, he's still alive. So anyway, it worked out for him. Red Uber was popped uh, as they tries to push onto... A Back onto the point, but they popped out of position right there way too early. Doesn't um, they are continuing to push right here? I'm not sure about this, as uh, Boa isn't sure either. That's Marika, remember. And as much as he loves his country, he does not want to lead his team into defeat, uh, trying his best not to be sniped, dancing all over the place. He too was a dancer in a past life, um, and when that heavy comes out, he just gets out of there. But can he escape from this spy? Oh, it's Demo V spy, and that's going to be very difficult. Uh, lock and load will push him away a little bit, um, but uh, I don't remember where I was going with that. All right, we'll be back after the pause. And we're back after that incomplete thought. Um, it will remain incomplete because I have no idea. Uh, ah, sorry, I just got to fix something real quick. Okay, there we go. Um, so time's about even here. Pretty darn close. Uh, remember, Rex is in the lead 2-0. So uh, definitely um, want... To, I, sorry, I'm getting distracted I'm also streaming at the same time. Apparently, there are no medals at stake here, which makes me very, very mad. Because um, this is a lower bracket final. So I did know this was lower bracket, but I didn't know there are no medals in that. Um, that that bothers me very much. There, if there's, All right, well, there's pride in this, I guess. But if there's no medals, really, these guys should be in bed by now. <laughs> Just kidding, they're doing a great job. Rags defending the point really well right here. Uh, we're going to see one more push from Blue Team. We've seen it before, and it has been effective. Both these teams have been really good in their last-minute pushes, been able to hold on to the point, and then uh, it's come down to the wire quite a few times. So uh, we will wait for that push. Uh, soldier coming in on the med. Will he be able to get the kill? Oh, Boa. Murka took so much damage right there. Uh, soldier's still alive and finally Rando goes down. Oh man, but if he had taken one more shot at Murka, the medic, uh, this would be a different story. Right now though, we have about 70% Uber. No, this blue actually took down the medic right there. There's 100% Uber. Qual is going to get some of that. Yeah, Ubered Scout. Why not? Um, only a few seconds left right here as I think the best opportunity, the best chance for Blue has faded. They're losing players right now as they just try to get onto the point. Red, meanwhile, has enough in reserve that they will be able to hold on to this. Here comes a heavy, but no, Mi Mixo Lydian goes down. So there we go. 
that is calling GG. Looks like they're only playing to three, so that will mean a Rags is the winner of this lower bracket. Uh, let me get the full title for you. It was the Single Elimination Steel Season 9 Bracket 3 Bronze Match. So, there you go. So, congratulations to Rags. Uh, well played for both teams. Very entertaining to watch. Definitely closer than 3-1 makes it seem. But, there are your final scores. A lot of fun stuff going on. Rando. Uh, but also this blue, those soldiers were having way too much fun on this map. Uh, they need to be curbed. Soldiers OP. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching, have a good day.